What is this? Is it a Batmobile? Of course not. Although the shape shows that it is worthy of being Batman's rides to eradicating crimes in Gotham City, that's an electric supercar called the Aerial Hypercar, is produced and unveiled by Aerial Motors, a British automotive firm. The company believes it will be the fastest accelerating and most advanced supercar in history. The two-seater supercar is powered by a 1200 bhp electric motor to drive its four wheels. Coupled with the revolutionary turbine range extender powertrain, the chassis and powertrain of tomorrow's supercar today, as Ariel puts it, is the result of a three-partner, three-year project supported by the government and will be revealed later this month at the Cynics Low Carbon Vehicle LCV, show at Millbrook Proving Ground. Built on an aluminium monocoque chassis, the new Ariel is expected to weigh around 1,600 kg and to be clad with carbon fiber body panels, although the exterior shape is still in development. It is also stated that the power from this electric motor is supplied by a Cosworth 800 volts 62 kilowatt hours lithium ion battery pack which is claimed to be able to provide a range around 250 kilometers. Furthermore, the aerial hypercar is claimed to be able to accelerate from 0 to 96 kilometers per hour in about 2 seconds, 0 to 161 kilometers per hour in about 4.4 seconds, and can be driven to a top speed of 250 kilometers per hour. It's not a big car, and it doesn't have conventional supercar proportions. At 4.3 meters it's about the length of a golf, but considerably wider, 1970 millimeters is full supercar scale. But it doesn't look wide, especially from behind, because of that tall, domed rear deck. At 1,354 mm, it's around 200 mm taller than a Lotus Evija or Ferrari 296 GTV. They both have what we'd call conventional proportions, cab board, glass tilted back, visual weight on the rear. This doesn't. You could almost think it's front engine. Quite like the McMurtry Sperling in that regard, or the Gianetta Acula, remember that? First unveiled in 2019, and still apparently in progress. For those of you who may be interested in owning the Ariel Hypercar, the company also gave a good news, it will start producing it by 2024, while for the prices is predicted that it will be around $1.120 million, 